everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a very in-depth video all about my hair care routine. I've had a lot of questions and requests from you all to do one of these videos and kind of explain to you what I use on my hair on a daily basis, kind of what extensions I use, what color I use to dye my own hair. So I really wanted to just kind of show you guys and lay it all out there on all the different products that I use and that I've been loving. I did have a traumatic ombre experience when I was in high school. It really, really damaged my hair. I will never bleach my hair again. I've learned from that awful experience. So I really swear by these products because they really helped get my hair back to how it is today and really nourished and healthy, long and shiny. So this is just going to be a pretty quick overview. I have a lot of products so I'm not going to go too in depth with kind of what they do but I'm just going to kind of spill everything out there for you all and kind of show you what I've been loving. I really consider these all my holy grail products. I will leave timestamps down below on the different sections that I'll be talking about if you're interested in just watching one of those sections. But if you want to see all the products that I absolutely love putting on my hair then just keep on watching. So I'm going to start out with the most expensive thing I probably spent on my hair which are my extensions if I'm ever wearing extensions these are the ones I'm wearing I absolutely love these these are by foxy locks can you just see how beautiful these are I believe I have the deluxe set which is the 160 gram set I don't remember what color I use I will leave it linked down below so you guys can go check it out if you're interested but these are very affordable the quality is amazing the clips that are on the wefts are really really sturdy so they go nowhere on my hair I do tease my hair a little bit on the places that I do put the wefts so they stay all day when I'm wearing these for a really long amount of time so I love that but I just love the color they match me perfectly and they're not too heavy for my hair they don't weigh my hair down these are very voluminous very long I think these are 20 inches as well so they're just perfect for every day especially because my hair is very long already so it looks very natural on me but you can get them kind of styled and cut to your hair so they look really natural and they blend in really nicely I didn't have to do that because again my hair is very long already so these are a little bit shorter than my actual hair length so I absolutely love these extensions. I used to use the Bellamy ones, but I have fallen in love with Foxy Locks, and I just think they're such good quality for the price you pay, and they look absolutely beautiful in your hair. So next, I get a lot of questions asking about the color I use on my hair. I actually dye my hair personally. I think it just saves a lot of money, and it saves time for me to sit in the salon for a couple hours. So I use stuff from Sally's. I know people are like, do not dye your hair yourself. Do not use box dye. I don't use any box dye. I use professional grade dye that I buy from Sally's, and it's so cheap. I think I spend $15 to $20 on my hair each time I dye it. This is the developer that I use. It's by L'Oreal. It's their color cream 20 volume developer. I would just typically do a hair color cocktail depending on what I'm feeling that day. So I have a couple different shades. I used to love Lush Cherry. I used to wear this all the time by itself. This is number 526. This is my favorite color out of five that I have here and it's a beautiful color. This is very kind of warm but it has a violet base so it's a really cool color. It's beautiful and this is my favorite one but if I'm feeling Feeling kind of edgy I will mix different colors so I also have number five medium brown number three natural black number four dark brown and number 4.1 dark ash brown so like I said depends on how I'm feeling that day if I want more of a warm undertone more of an ashy or cool undertone more of a neutral just really depends on what I'm feeling so I will kind of mix the cocktail up and just apply it on my hair I do it in the shower it's really easy and I just absolutely love using those products on my hair so next for the products I use in the shower I am very picky when it comes to shampoos and conditioners I have tried so many different brands and haven't really found anything I liked until this brand popped up at my drugstore. Now I typically will not use drugstore products on my hair unless it's like a hairspray or something like that or a heat protectant but I love these and these have made a dramatic difference on my hair. So these are the L'Oreal Hair Expertise Ever Pure Sulfate Free which is very important color care system and this is the volume shampoo and conditioner. I love these. The only reason I typically don't use drugstore shampoos and conditioners is because they have sulfates in them but this is sulfate free. This is great for colored hair. This actually does give me a lot of volume which is surprising. When I have used other volumizing shampoos and conditioners, they leave a lot of grit in my hair and build up and I hate that and I do not find that with these. So I absolutely love these. These are my absolute favorite. I think I've repurchased these at least six times now and they're just amazing for my hair. The next product I use that I swear by, this is a product that I think really has helped my hair grow really long and healthy. This is the Macadamia Natural Oil Deep Repair Mask. Now this you can get at any drugstore. You can find it at Ulta. This is a little price 
pricey. I think it's about $30 or so, but I use this about every two weeks and I love this. I've gone through about five tubs of these. This smells absolutely amazing. It really, really helps your hair get really nourished. You can definitely feel a difference after you get out of the shower and you feel your hair just feels so silky and smooth. It's really easy to brush out. It just feels very healthy and kind of sturdy too. So I love this. If you had to go out and buy one thing from this entire video, this is what I would recommend. This is what I swear by for helping my hair grow and helping it get so healthy. So this is definitely a holy grail product and I will forever repurchase this. So the next couple products I use are for after I get out of the shower before I brush my hair out. So the first one I've talked about before in one of my empties videos, I love this. This is the Healthy Sexy Hair Soy Tri Wheat Leave-In Conditioner with soy and cocoa. This is absolutely amazing. I will spray this in my hair before I brush it out with my wet brush and I just love this. My hair gets really tangled really easily because it's so fine and thin. So I have to use this every single time I get out of the shower. This really makes a dramatic difference in how I brush my hair. It really kind of detangles everything in my hair so I don't have a dreadlock because I have had that before and it's not fun. So I love this. I swear by this and I will spray this on my hair every time I get out of the shower. And the one I use with it is the Matrix Biolage Hydrosaurus Daily Leave-In Tonic. This is for dry hair because I have really thin, fine hair. I find that my hair can be really dry sometimes because it's just so thin. So this is awesome. This is like a brain moisturizer for your hair. And this just leaves my hair really nice and healthy and really hydrated so the ends aren't really brittle and such, especially when I'm using a lot of different styling tools on my hair. This is really important and I've only bought one of these and I've had this for like a year and a half. I still have like half left. This has lasted me so long and I absolutely love this. So this next part I don't use on my hair every single time I get out of the shower. I typically use this when I want an extra boost of nourishment and hydration to my hair. So my hair can get really dry and frizzy sometimes so I love putting this in there. This is the Healthy Sexy Hair Soya One It All 22 in 1 Leave-In Treatment. So this is the same line that my leave-in conditioner is from so I absolutely love this. Again this is a 22 in 1 treatment so it's going to do so many different things for your hair. I'll read off all the different claims it says. <laughs> So that is a lot of different things in one and it really does all those different things in one I absolutely love this and again this is really awesome to put on your damp hair kind of wash it out it really helps detangle as well and I do find that it gives me a lot of volume too so like I mentioned earlier I do not wash my hair every single day I used to do that in high school and I found that it really dried out my hair so quickly so I cannot afford to do that with my hair anymore I've trained my hair to the point where I can go at least four to five days without washing it which I know it sounds gross but like you can definitely train your hair to do that and I have found a product that is a holy grail product. I will never use anything else besides this and I just love this dry shampoo. Finding a good dry shampoo is essential if you want to try and teach your hair to kind of go a couple days without washing it. This is really going to help your hair absorb oil, kind of keep it clean and smell nice and just look really put together even though you did not wash your hair. So this is the Batiste dry shampoo. I absolutely love the deep and dark brown sensitive color one. I have used the other ones without any color on them. Because I have darker hair I do find that those do leave a little bit more of a white cast on my hair. I just have to really rub it in with my fingers. So I don't mind it too much. I will still use it if I have that on hand and that's the only one I have but I always have to have these in my drawers because I will never go a day without using this. I use this every single day. Even if I need an extra boost of volume and texture in my hair I will put some of this in because it's awesome. Again it has the color in there so it kind of just fills in those spots and I just love this thing. I again if you watch any of my trash videos, there's at least five of these in there. I've gone through so many of these I can't even remember and they are so affordable as well. So for the next product, if you style your hair a lot, you probably should have one of these and be using one of these on your hair before you're styling your hair with different styling tools. This is a heat protectant. I love this one by Tresemme. It's the Thermal Creations Heat Tamer Leave-In Spray. This is a heat protection spray that goes up to 450 degrees for your styling tools. So this is really important, especially because I have dry hair. Styling tools can really dry out my hair kind of leave my ends really frizzy and kind of just like fall off. So heat protectant is very necessary for me and if you're using styling tools in general you should probably be using a heat protectant just because a lot of heat in your hair can really damage it later on so I highly suggest this one and it has definitely made a difference in the healthiness of my hair. So the styling tools that I love using are both by Numi. This is the Megastar Flat Iron. I have mentioned this a couple times. I use this every single time you see my hair straight. This is my favorite. It heats up to about 450 degrees which is insane but it heats up in like 30 seconds so it's probably the one of the fastest heating styling tools I have and I love this. This is really nice and healthy for my hair because it 
will leave my hair really silky and shiny, but also straight, which I absolutely love. So the Megastar is my absolute favorite. The Numi 32 millimeter wand is my favorite for when I curl my hair. I really curl my hair just because I like my hair straight on me personally a little bit more, but when I do curl it, I love the 32 millimeter, and I just love how it gives me like really nice beachy waves. And when I use this curling wand, my curls will last in my hair for two to three days. I'll wake up with even nice beachier curly waves, and I love it. So, so these are my two favorite styling tools from Numi, and I highly recommend and both of them. So that's couple products I have are styling products and I have five different ones but that's just because I love putting styling products on my hair. So I'm going to talk about a hairspray first. This is the one I love using. This is the Kenra Platinum Finishing Spray. This is a maximum hold hairspray but what I love about this even though it's a maximum hold hairspray it's not very crunchy. You can still work with your hair and kind of brush it out even though it is maximum hold. It's still really nice. It leaves your hair really nice and silky and shiny so I love this. It really keeps my curls intact for the entire day so this is my favorite one and it smells really good as well. So the next product I have is also by Kenra Platinum. This is their Silkening Mist. This gives me a beautiful shine to my hair. I spray this in my hair every so often after I will style it with one of those Numi tools and it just gives such nice shiny hair. And whenever I think of shiny hair, I think of really healthy hair. So that's why I love this. It just makes my hair feel and look really healthy. So I absolutely love this. So I also have the Bumble and Bumble BB Thickening Dry Spread Spray. I am almost out of this and it really makes me sad so I cannot wait to buy a new one. But this is a dry spray that creates instant fullness and holds airy texture. So this is what I will spray into my hair in certain spots closer to the roots of my head just to give me a little bit of extra volume. This is a great finishing spray. Again, it just gives you a lot of extra added texture to your hair and volume and just like more oomph. It kind of like that sexy appeal. So I love this and this smells really amazing as well. So one that I've actually gotten recently, I mentioned this in my February favorites, but I wanted to mention it now because I absolutely love this. I've used this all the time since I've gotten it. This is the Way Hair Care Texturizing Hairspray. This it does say it's a hairspray, but I find this more as like a volumizing spray more than a hairspray. It is very lightweight, so it's not going to really weigh your hair down because it says it's a hairspray. You can really work this into your hair and kind of give your hair a lot more added texture. It's very similar to the effect that the BB Thickening Spray would give you, but I just love the smell of this, and I think it gives me a little bit more volume and oomph than the other one, so this has become my absolute favorite, and it smells divine. If you can smell this, you can get this at Sephora soon, if not already, and I highly recommend this one. Alright, last but not least, I have this Fido Ultra Glossing Finishing Serum. This is for unruly, frizzy, and rebellious hair. Sometimes I find that I have a lot of flyaways both up top and towards the ends of my hair. If I find that I have that after I style my hair, I will place a little bit of this in the palm of my hand and kind of run it through to kind of warm it up and just kind of brush it through my hair, especially focusing it on the ends. I just find that it really controls my unruly little flyaways and it makes my hair look really nice and shiny as well. I know this is a little pricey, but I really love this because it's not a very heavy oil or serum, so it's not gonna weigh down your hair, but it really gets the job done and it really tames my flyaways. So I highly recommend this if you have those flyaways that you just cannot tame, this is the product for you. All right, so that's it for this video. I really hope you guys found this helpful and I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I know this is a lot of products and I don't use every single one of these styling products on my hair on a day-to-day -day basis, but that's just kind of a basic rundown of what I put on my hair and kind of what I use in my my hair care routine. So I hope you really enjoyed this and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!